Hi, it's Paul Nielsen from Nielsen Fitness Toronto and my team member Jonathan and I are here to show you how to do a bridge on a chair, which is great for your core. So Jonathan, from this position what I want you to do is to straighten out your legs, lift your hips up a little bit higher so your hips are nice and level and the muscles we're engaging right now include the rectus abdominis and if you squeeze really tight like you're stuck in traffic and you just drank two liters of water, a little muscle called your transverse abdominis. Work your way up to doing this for 30 seconds. Be sure to breathe as you do so. And once you feel that you can move to the next level, one thing you can do is just lift up your right foot one inch, Jonathan, and bring it down. And now the same with your left and down. And work your way up until you can do 10 reps per side alternating. And this adds an extra element of instability for your core, which engages little muscles like your uh, ones that's called your quadratus lumborum or your internal and external obliques if you want to get technical. Another thing you can do too is, Jonathan, let's bring your leg out, let's abduct your right hip. Let's bring your leg out abduction. Nice. And then alternate doing the left. So the bridge can be very challenging not only for your core, but it's a nice mobilizer for your hips too. For more great tips like this, check out nielsenfitness.com.